Hi, I'm Sherry from A Quilting Life. And I'm Chelsea from Chelsea Stratton Designs. And we are here today to share with you our brand new Strawberry Lemonade collection. Today is the first day that we are able to share and we thought it would be really fun to film a video where we can go through all of the prints up close and personal and talk about each and every one. We'll be sharing more about our quilts in videos over the upcoming weeks, but today it's all about the fabric. Okay, so now we get to take an up-close look at all of the colors and prints in the new Strawberry Lemonade collection. As always, we have a good group of low volumes. Mom and I just love these. So we're gonna start out with our larger floral and lots of color in this one and something really cute that we added was strawberries for the strawberry. Love those strawberries. <laughs> love those strawberries, guys. And we just, I will open just this print up just because I want you guys to see how pretty it is. So this is our large floral, lots of colors, mom, right? Four or yeah. five different ones of these? Yeah. Okay, so we actually have also a medium to large floral in this as well. These, these florals are great for backings. Uh, we love this one, so we have two. Borders. Yep, borders, lots of florals in this collection. I especially love this one with the dots on the background, the triple flowers. We think this one is so cute. So you have that. And then of course, a smaller floral. Mom has been using this one as sashings and I think it's turned out really great. So the little tossed posy flowers in this. And we also have some really great basics in this collection. So I do wanna tell you for reference, this print right here is what our tone on tone print is. So this design is what's on this one if you can't see it up close. We love this little kind of spinning pinwheel basic right here and the confetti type of look. So these two are actually the same. We've been using this tone on tone for everything. The matching color is Bella 200. So we haven't moved on from that color. We think it's probably it's our favorite background color out of the Bellas. And you might recognize our dot print, our circle dots from, we've had this in multiple collections, right, Mom? Simply yeah. Delightful, specifically. And we just had to bring it back because we wanted this not only in the ivory confetti mix, but in other colors as well. Okay, so before we move on to the next colorway, you might notice this print on the table. And this is our Cheater Cloth Hexi print um, in the collection. It is not included in the bundle, so you'll have to buy the hexagon print separate. And we have had so much fun with this. So the circle dots is the background on it. And then you have the the hexagon flowers as well. And we just adore this print. Mom has used it for backing so far and she has even cut one hexi out, right, Mom? Yes, you can cut one of these hexagon flowers out and substitute it for a charm square. And even when it's sewn into your quilt or project, you'll get to see the whole hexagon flower. And also one more thing about this is that it is 60 inches wide. Ooh, good, thank you for bringing that up. So yeah, you, this is something we're very excited about and that we were excited to include in this collection. So that's kind of a fun surprise with strawberry lemonade that we have for you all. Okay, so we brought back, this is the same orange from Simply Delightful that you might remember. So that coordinates with this. It's, I think the Bella Solid. Mom will have a blog post, it's apricot. Amelia apricot to be exact. We had to bring back the gingham print from Seashore Drive and we have it in all new colors and it's on the bias already. So 
That is very fun. It's perfect for bindings and obviously just regular piecing. So we have the orange in the gingham and we have it in the triple tossed floral as well for the oranges. Okay. So something we really wanted to do, as I mentioned, is we kind of wanted to coordinate with past colors we have. We like to extend the palette a little bit with Sherry and Chelsea, but this is the carnation pink from Simply Delightful as well. Just if you wanted to know, we have it in the strawberry large floral for you all. Love this one. Ah, for borders, so good and backings if you want, but I have used this one for borders. We have our circle dots. And then we have our medium tossed floral as well. And this is a new print that we've designed. We love this one. Love it so much. It's so cute, you guys. It has the stems with the leaves and then all the little florals with it as well. So we are absolutely loving this new print in and the collection. It reminds me of the hexagon flowers. It too. does actually. So yes. Mom, I love that you brought that up. That's so true. Okay. So we have a good group of pinks, but what would our pinks be <laughs> without having some red in there too? So let me lay these out. Okay. So we have this is, guys, this is probably one of my favorite prints from the collection, but we have the tossed tri floral in the red in geranium. And then this is a great transition from our uh, geranium to the carnation pink. Yeah. We have it in the gingham as well. Don't you feel like this works well with the pinks and with the reds? Both you of them. You can put it with either pile. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Nope, I totally agree. And then we have the medium tossed floral in this and the circle dots too. And I feel like we, we do have a lot of florals in this collection, but it's also a great mix with the basics because like you still have dots in this flower, in this floral print that makes it kind of have a balance. Okay, so if you are a Balboa Seashore Drive fan, you know how much we love the citrine. And this was a specific color that we wanted to bring back into this collection. We have it in the tossed triple floral. And this is the pinwheel print as well for a nice little basic. We love this color. And there are obviously some colors and collections that we absolutely know we're going to come back to. So this is that kind of bright yellow green print that's going to transition us into the darker green prints in this collection. Okay, so I love this collection because you have a good variety of different colors of green. And we kind of mixed, this is a pistachio Bella and a fresh grass Bella. And so we have a couple of different shades past the citrine. We love the posy print in the lighter pistachio green. And our, obviously our new favorite floral that reminds mom of the hexagons. That was a great uh, little tidbit she shared. We have that in this one as well. And then this gingham that kind of transitions between both of the green color ways. And I have really appreciated the green because I have quilts with some, my botanical remix has some stems in it. And so we have this medium floral in the darker green and the large floral. I love this dark green in the large floral print. I think it's so pretty. Oh, also I want to share that the quote, the salvage quote was really yeah. cute. It says, when, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade, which I know you've probably all heard, but I just thought it was adorable. Before you pack those up, Chelsea used the citrine with the greens in a lot in the stems on her botanical remix quilt and it's just a fun combination that i wouldn't have thought of but after i saw her do it with those blocks i just totally want to mix the citrines with the greens thanks mom <laughs> yeah no i love all the greens together i actually should have brought them all out together at the same time but they're really pretty together i think they're great okay so we are going to move on to mom's favorite color <laughs> 
We all know I'd probably choose reds and pinks, but mom loves aqua, and this is kind of a minty, wouldn't you, a Shay? Minty aqua. Yeah, minty yeah. aqua. I'm gonna have to find the actual Bella Solid. I'm not sure if it's mint. It's not in the catalog. So okay. Maybe... Yeah, I will give it to you. I'm pretty sure it's mint. And we have the gingham, which, I mean, we have to have the gingham in an aqua, I feel like. So we love that one. And you really get this minty color now with these other prints. And so we have the triple floral with the dots in it, and then the tossed posies. And I love that this has the teal flowers and yes. the red flowers. I almost want to throw it in a red, white, and blue quilt. Like how yes, pretty would that so be? Pretty. So love this print. And then the large floral in the mint as well. I think that this one is really cute too. You get to start seeing kind of how this teal color plays with that mint. Okay, so lots of colors in this collection. The last color we have is our Betty's Teal is the Bella Solid. If you're wondering, we have the medium tossed floral in this and the circle dots. And then, guys, I love this print. I think it's so pretty because these flowers are all white in this one. I love that. And we ha it's the same in the green. But then we have this uniform kind of hexy flower that's really fun as well. So lots of new colors in this and lots of things to mix together we found that we really love. And we're just really excited about this collection and think it not only provides you a couple of new colors, but lots of other colors that you can add to your palette as well. And just speaking of pre-cuts, we have fat quarters, fat eighth bundles, layer cakes, charm packs, mini charms, and we both have honey bun patterns as well. So we th that's something fun that normally mom will have a honey bun quilt, I have one too, and then jelly rolls too. So we've got all the pre-cuts, plus remember that this hexi print the 60 inch wide is separate from the bundle so it's not included in the bundle but you can buy it separately great for backings great for fussy cutting you said yes for that so we're just really excited and feel really grateful with the strawberry lemonade collection if you're loving it make sure you talk to your local or favorite quilt shop we also feel very grateful to be featured on the cover of the Peace catalog. And if you have a chance to see it online, we could post a link to it that you can go view it. There's um, an article in there that Lindsay McRae wrote and she interviewed us in that as well. So you can hear some fun things about our family and about Billy too, which is always really exciting. So we are excited about being on the Peace catalog as well. We. Hope you love this fabric as much as we do. We're excited and we're excited to see all the fun projects that you come up with to make with it. Okay, so that's it for your up close preview of Strawberry Lemonade. This collection is showing to shops now and it will be in the stores in January of 2024. We're super excited about this collection as you have probably gathered from today's video and just be on the lookout for all of the upcoming videos where we will share our quilts and projects with the collection. If you enjoyed today's video, please share it with a friend, hit the like button, and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Thanks so much for stopping by.